Labour Market Activation Fund is a new fund. We've just announced preliminary details of uh, 20 million euro investment in 2010, specifically targeted at under 35s, uh, unemployed with a background in retail, in manufacturing or in construction. Uh, they're the areas that are taking the biggest hit at the moment. Um, for those without a leaving cert, it will allow them to skill up to a leaving cert level and beyond. And for those with a leaving cert, it will allow them to reskill and to refocus their qualifications on areas where there might be new job opportunities in time to come, such as the green economy, such as the smart economy, uh, and areas like that. It's specifically open to private training operators or not-for-profit training operators. Um, and the 20 million that we're investing in this program is in addition to the 780 million that we'll be investing with false training programs in 2010. That represents a, a very significant response to unemployment. We will be uh, placing uh, a formal tender notice on e-tenders within the next two to three weeks, uh, advising of the specific requirements of the course, advising of the specific qualification uh, areas that we're looking for, and companies, Irish companies, will be invited to tender to uh, provide courses based on the circumstances in their area, based on their particular strengths as a company and their particular analysis of how they can respond to the challenge. Uh, that will go up. Um, there will be a pretty tight timeline because we're very anxious to have this programme delivered to people uh, as soon as possible by the beginning of the summer, that courses will be available through the Labour Market Activation Fund and that people can start reskilling and getting uh, ready for new job opportunities during 2010. Uh, we wanted up and running by the beginning of the summer and we've issued the preliminary notice now. It was issued in all of uh, the papers on the day of the 12th of February so the companies could start preparing their tender documents now and as I said we hope to be formally in, in a position to place a notice for tenders on e-tenders within the next three weeks. As soon as the providers are up and running and are nominated, we'll be advertising the courses that, that are available, advertising the geographical locations of where they're available so that people can engage with the training provider directly. And uh, in time, that, available, that information will be available through local employment offices, through social welfare offices and through false offices.